Seven-year-old Jalen Hackworth is preoccupied with this virtual reality headset. Well, they can um, stick me in my chest so I can get my medicine in it. While receiving an infusion at USA Children's and Women's Hospital. I think I'm on another level. She might be in Mobile. I got three stars on my first try. But she feels like she's in outer space. I see a dog with bones and, and we have to go. And I see the moon and I see another space. And I see a dog grammar with um, an astronaut. With USA has several virtual reality headsets. So this is the Oculus Go, and um, it's one of the only standalone virtual reality mobile units. Many of them donated by Cade Rivers. I spent two and a half years in the hospital. So I've been here, I've been in the situation that these kids are in, and I know how boring it can be. <laughs> so we're here to bring a little bit of fun. He suffered from a blood disease as a little boy and practically lived in the hospital. He knew one day he wanted to help other children. You look funny without it too. At age 28, he started a nonprofit called Wings of Joanne. Yeah, that's your buddy. He's going to sing to you. Wings of Joanne is a charity, you know, based around bringing virtual reality to kids that are stuck in the hospital. And it's named after and in honor of my bone marrow donor, Joanne. He volunteers, helping the hospital set up their VR headsets. The great thing about this virtual reality headset is that the patient puts it on. Whoa, this is so neat. They can play games, they can watch their favorite shows for hours and maybe even forget about why they're here. Nurse Cassie Etheridge says the headsets have been a great distraction. Um, having a four-year-old sit in a chair for eight hours can be kind of difficult, so this is awesome for them to like, give them something to do and feel like they're not stuck in their chair. It's been awesome. <laughs> We've had kids pull it off and like double-check their surroundings to make sure they were where they thought they were. And River adds, if these children forget where they are for just a little while, that's a good thing. This is cool. For What's Working, with photojournalist Jason Garcia, I'm Devin Walsh.